In this lesson, we're going to be talking about importing data into Dratus. There are a number of different types of tools that Dratus can work with, and one of them is Nessus. Now, what I'm going to import here are results from a Nessus scan, and I'm going to import from file. You can see the menu item up here, and I'm actually going to use the new importer. And I'm going to leave this alone for a second. This is the log where I actually started the Dratus server. You can see the log file here, and it's just scrolling along here. It's kind of doing a tail minus F. And one of the reasons I want to show you that is if we happen to run into a case where the upload causes problems or fails for some reason, you can always go over to the log here and get some additional information. What I want to do, though, is I actually want to do a Nessus upload, and I'm going to browse. I'm going to go to my home directory here, and now I'm going to do this Nessus file here. And now what's happening is the file's being imported, and you can see that we've queued a job to import the Nessus file into the server. And I could go back over here to the log, and you can see that we ran the uploader, and we've done some work on the file. If I come back over here to the Dratus framework, I've got uploaded files here as a category now. And it looks like the upload manager is still working. We haven't actually put the uploaded files in at this point. We can go back to the upload manager and we can keep watching. And at some point, the file will actually get imported into the Dratus framework. In the meantime, what I want to do is I want to take a look at doing the other types of files. We're just going to take a look at the importer and take a look at the different file types that we could import. We've got burps, we've got nexpos, we've got nessus, nicto, nmap. If I were to write the nmap output to a file, I could actually import the nmap results. We've got OpenVAS, Retina, SureCheck, Typhon. Here's Zap, which is the Z-Attack proxy, which is the proxy-based scanner and web vulnerability tool by OWASP. And here's W3AF. And we'll take a look at W3AF in later lessons as well as some of these other tools. But in the meantime, I just wanted to show you the different plugins that are available that give you the ability to install or upload a number of different file types or outputs from these different tools so that we can put them into Dratus and help be able to categorize and organize all of that different information here. So this is how you would actually import data into Dratus, and the data would be available in Dratus to be able to look at and be able to do things with so that you can help organize and be able to see what you're doing with the pen test that you're involved with.